Hello and welcome to St Hill's virtual options video. The purpose of this video is to help pupils make informed choices on what subjects they wish to continue with until year 11 and their final examinations. My advice to pupils first and foremost is to think about subjects that they are good at and that they enjoy. Try not to select too many subjects of a similar nature. Getting the balance right is important. Finally, ask for help in making your choices and make sure that you take your time to make the right decision. Once a pupil has selected their options, they may be unable to change their mind. The most common mistakes we see pupils make when selecting their options are pupils choosing the subject because their friends are, or because they like a certain teacher. Friendships can change. There are no guarantees they will be in the same class as friends or have the same teacher that they may hope to have. You and your child will see, when looking at the choices, that they can choose between GCSE and BTEC subjects. These are different qualifications. GCSE is a more academic qualification with exams at the end of the course, whereas BTEC is vocational, meaning it is more work focused. And because of this, most of the assessment is completed as you go by producing portfolios of evidence of learning. People should be encouraged to use the support available from staff to help make choices. Myself, Mrs. Ellison, Mr. Gibbon Hayes, Mrs. Sangster, our careers advisor, and subject specific staff are all available to talk through options with pupils. Contact details are available at the end of this video. We understand that choosing options is a daunting time for pupils. Hopefully, the information that follows from staff will help pupils to make informed choices and allow the opportunity to ask any questions that may arise. The Key Stage 4 curriculum is made up of compulsory subjects and three option choices. Pupils will continue to study English Language, English Literature, Maths, Science and RE, as well as PSHE and Core PE, which will not result in a GCSE qualification. The three option choices are available from the subjects listed beside me. Option blocks have been created and when pupils complete their option form, they will choose a subject from each block. This will ensure a balanced choice is made and workloads are manageable. Some courses have specific requirements. For music, you must be able to play an instrument or be willing to learn. And for computer science, you must be on at least a grade three in maths due to the challenging mathematical content on the course. Today this video has been released, the options information booklet has gone live on the website and pupils have taken part in a carousel of taster activities in the options subjects. Pupils also have a dummy options form so they can think about what they would like to choose. The week beginning the 12th of April, the options form will be released to pupils to choose their options. This needs to be completed and handed in by the 23rd of April when choices will be collated. The final choices will be released to pupils on Friday the 28th of May. If you have any questions, please contact the school office or your child's tutor via Teams and myself, Mr Oren or the subject staff will get back to you.